Why did we move from the Nokia 2110 to one of these? The reality is a battery technology, you know, like in the late 1800s, um, wasn't there yet. Battery technology is very close to being there right now. But I don't know if it's 100% there because the cost is still very high. And that's the biggest downside of a fully battery electric vehicle is, is the cost of the battery itself. I mean, I, you, you might know I drive a Jaguar I-Pace, which is a full yeah. battery electric. And it's got a 90 kilowatt hour battery, which um, is probably the most expensive part of that car. So, so then you ask yourself, well, if we can't bring the cost of these vehicles down, if that is the future, because I think it is, if that is the future and, and we can't bring the cost of the vehicle down in the short term, how do we make a middle step? What are the, what are the, you know, what is the middle step? Mm -hmm. And the middle step is the hybrid. Let's, let's talk about, let's talk about the environmental side mm -hmm. um, and the hybrid and battery electric side. Um, many people say that this move to hybrid or electric vehicles is because we're trying to save the environment. I am fully behind anything that tries to save our planet, but I don't think that that should be the primary driver. I think it's a natural downstream consequence of going fully battery electric or going hybrid and then battery electric, but I don't think it's the for me, it's not the main driver of why we should do it. I know that Elon Musk says that it saves the planet and all that, and that's great, right? But in my head, this is just my personal opinion, is that it's better technology. It lasts longer. Um, uh, uh, there's less noise pollution. There's less chance of the car breaking down. Um, it's more efficient. So there's a whole bunch of factors there that I think precede the environmental argument. Because many people say, oh, no, we can't go to electric vehicles because actually producing a lithium-ion battery is more cost-heavy on the environment than an ICE vehicle. Well, fair enough. Maybe there's an argument for that because I've seen lots of things that say that it takes an electric vehicle, I think, up to uh, five to eight years to become cost neutral from an environmental point of view because of the lithium ion um, and, and, and its mining and all that stuff in order to be cost neutral with an ICE vehicle. Okay. Mm. But is that the real reason we're doing this? It's one of yeah. the but I think the, for me, the overarching reason is why did we move from the Nokia 2110 to one of these? Is it because of yeah. the environmental uh, 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 reasons? No, it's because this is better technology.